Say you receive an unexpected bonus at work and you want to use it to pay down your debt. Should you apply the windfall to your loan with the highest interest rate or the longest term? Unfortunately, there's no simple answer to this question. The math behind loan accounting is complicated and getting the right answer is important, so it's best to use a calculator. We've built one for you to play with after this video. For now, just follow along and try to see the big picture. Each of your loans affects your finances in a unique way. Some of your liabilities cost you more in money while others cost you more in time. One decision you don't need a calculator for is choosing which of the two you're more interested in saving. There's no right answer, but here's a helpful way to think about your decision. If you're trying to achieve your financial independence, saving time is probably your best choice. Getting out of debt as quickly as possible so you can cover your own cost of living is more important than maximizing the return on your money. In the alternative, if you're trying to save for college or retirement, growing your wealth is likely to be your main concern, so saving money is your best option. Another really good practice is to limit yourself to paying off one loan at a time. When it comes to optimizing your finances, there's almost always a best move. Focusing on a single liability will keep you from spreading your efforts too thin. If you enter all your loans into Monger, you can avoid the need to continually monitor your own finances. By entering the details for each of your loans, the system will be primed to let you know when it's time to shift your focus. In the meantime, you can just sit back, relax, and enjoy some peace of mind.